be here from Monday. Anywhere you enter, everything shall be possible. Every impossibility shall be turned to possibility. Hey, hey, where they have rejected you, where they have rejected you, they will accept you. Where they have received you, they will receive you from today. Or oh, something new will happen to your life. Something new will happen to your life. Listen up to me. Let me give you something. When the Holy Ghost comes upon you, you see, everybody has beauty. Every human being has what? Beauty. But when the Holy Ghost adds up to your beauty, you become beautiful. You know why? Because the white beauty, there are two ways. You have beauty and what? Full. So your beauty cannot be full. The Holy Ghost comes on you. When the Holy Ghost comes on you, your beauty becomes full and you are called beautiful. May the beauty of the Holy Ghost fall upon you from today. May the beauty of Jehovah God fall upon you today so that everywhere you go, you shall be called beautiful. Can you rise up and give a shout to the Lord our God? That's why someone said the Holy Ghost will come and you shall be turned into a man. You shall prophesy with them. Amen. So, like I was saying, Jesus said, but you receive power. Like the sister was teaching, he said, you will receive power, ability, efficiency, and might when the Holy Ghost comes. Now look, and Jesus said, you will be my witness. I want to explain this. You will be. Now, Jesus didn't say, you will witness about me. He didn't say you will testify about me. He didn't say you will go about telling people about you. He said you will be my witnesses. My, I want to explain that. So, so many people don't understand that scripture. Now, it's not a matter of you receiving a miracle and they come and say, I want to testify. When I say you will be my witness, what do you mean? See that when they see that this handkerchief, they see you as my witness. You should be surprised when you see my secretary. Is that right? Is that not what he said? He said you will be my witness. So when somebody says, "Oh, be my secretary," it means that there's coming a time when when somebody comes in there and sees you sitting on that chair, they know that you are the secretary to that person. Is that right? Now, Jesus said, you will be my witness. It means that as you are going in, they are seeing the witness of Jesus. As wherever you are, they are seeing the witness of Jesus. You, oh, your life is a witness. Your life is a witness. That is what Jesus was saying. Your life will be a witness. When people see you, they know something about what I have done in your life. 